Right, Kevin. So we're looking at uh, Death March by Cancer Bats. So, um, so what I'm going to do is I've got the song uh, in the headphones there, so I'm just going to play through it and just go through the different bits that way. So, all right, so we're in drop C, so uh, we'll just call this A, even though it's G. Um, and, uh, or chord of one, let's say one. And then, so we're going from the A, um, to the F, right? So that's chord of one to chord of minor six. Okay, so then, so you're just sliding between those two. And then in the uh, night after night section, same thing, only they add in, first time they do it, they add in just the fifth. Then the next for the next three times you've got the eighth added in there as well. And then they're putting in those bends kind of as, as the chord goes through. So um, so let's just keep going here. So you got that four times. Now the last time on the fourth time, right? Just keep You've got these ones. So what they do is they take the, the end bit of the upcoming riff and stick that at the very start of it, right? So you've got that that little section coming in before the uh, the, the chorus. So then you've got the chorus. So, we're going uh, fret 7, 6, 3, but you've got these little open chugs in there as well, so... So you got that, I think, four times, and then at the end of it, they... Then they repeat that section. So, next thing, we're into another verse where they just do exactly the same thing as they did the intro. So sliding through the chords, and then, so then we got the night after night section. And this time, uh, the night after night section, the eighth is there from the get-go, so it's so you've got right from the start. Okay, uh, yeah, so we got that four times again. Got the chorus riff, we've done that already, that's the same this time. Uh, no, let's keep going through here. Yeah, so at the end of it is again you've got the repeat of and then straight back in for another one. Yeah, that's at uh, two nineteen of the song. So so just keep yeah you'll 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 know when you uh, just by knowing the song anyway when they repeat that lower end bit of the riff. So. So now this time, so after that then, after those two iterations of the chorus, you've got um, uh, the verse again, only it, it's uh, it's heavy, and you're bringing in the eighth and you're bending it. So this is just before the solo. Yeah, so... So then, for the very last one of those, uh, he lets out the scream and the solo comes in then. Before the solo starts, instead of go, going down here, he goes up the octave. So you've got... Throws that bend in at the start. And then the solo starts. So, let me just have a quick listen here. Right, so we've got... So we've got uh, F going down to D, 15 to 12. Now, so for this one, what he's doing is... He's doing that kind of country thing where you're keeping the 8th uh, where it is and then bending the 5th up to the 6th. Um, so we've got... 
And as far as I can tell, I don't think he's putting the eighth in there on that lower chord. I think he's just going. Then we're back up here again. Goes up to the G then. And then he, I think he kind of goes up whatever frets he have, has left up here. He just kind of creeps up in a kind of a chaotic kind of way. Uh, all right. So then we go back to the... Okay, so then there's a little bit of a difference here. Uh, I, yeah, I gave you those those chords uh, for how, how long um, uh, the co each chord lasts, right? So you got one with six beats. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Right, so what you have there is one, 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 two, three, four, five, six, one, one, two, and then... Then we go down to um, the uh, eighth fret, and then they hold that for eight beats. So you've got this. So for the second half of the, the solo, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then you've got uh, some chorus repeats, and that's pretty much it. All right, so see you again with that one anyway. It's definitely a fun one to play along to, so uh, definitely get it from start to finish there. There's nothing too tough about it. So, all right, I'll see you in the next one.